Oh. Oh, it's right there. Like, oh, I can't see it. Did I get a photo of it or not? Ah! Oh my god! It is so creepy in VR. Oh! We're just gonna light these creepy candles. Paging Mr. Ghost. And then we're gonna run like hell. But I just heard what sounded like a freaking cat meowing. Smile. Woo! I don't have a cat. I hate the Revenant so much. Kind of legit freaked me out. Um, all right, we're just gonna focus on making a video. Oh my God, this is terrifying. That's a fun sign. <laughs> what a great way to start the video with ominous thunder. Welcome everybody to Phasmophobia in VR. This is my first video in this game, but also the first time I have played Phasmo in VR completely alone. Nobody else is home, it's one in the morning, it's just me, and I've been wanting to do this for a while. But earlier today, I was chilling, I was just sitting, and a door in my house just swung open. It was sitting ajar for the longest time and just it decided to just fling itself open. So that was cool. I took it as a sign. Brandon, it's time to play some Phasma VR. But today we're doing something very unique. We are hunting for ghost bunny rabbits. And uh, you know, usually I'd be, okay, we, chill Thunder. Usually I'd be grabbing a bunch of tools and stuff. But for them, all we need is a UV light, a dots projector, and a photo cam, which actually I believe the game luckily supplies you work with a couple of these tools out front. So let's go grab those. I will, however, take a flashlight, which you can attach to your belt. Obviously, you don't normally have this in the regular game, but because it's VR, you gotta have a place to store your stuff. I feel like I'm like a cowboy just ready to draw my lights. Hands in the sky, ghost. They don't call me the fastest hands in the, what? they don't call me that. They call me slow hand brand. All right, perfect. There are those supplies. I guess we could just go crazy. And the cool thing about VR is you can hold two things at once, which is kind of a, I guess, small benefit. Luckily, we're just trying to get these bunny rabbits. So, oh God, I don't know why that's creeping me out. Maybe we go in with one of these and one of these. So I, we're off to a great start. Let's get this door open. Now I did watch how to do this. I just saw a very brief idea of how you do this challenge, but beyond that. What? Let go, jeez. <laughs> I was like, why was I making so much noise? Okay, we've already got some activity here. So basically, you use the UV light and you just try to figure out the bunny's location. It leads to nests, I believe. You use the UV to guide you there, which boom, and then use the dots to find the actual ghost. So it's not here. I like how I'm just crouching through this whole time like giving you a hobbit point of view. All right, oh great. Now I'd rather follow it that way, but let's just get the basement out of the way. Let's open you up. And, oh, great, all right. This is so difficult in VR, everything. It also is just like beyond being janky, everything in VR is huge. Like if I'm looking up at this door, it's massive. Um, doors are the hardest part so far. So loud. All right, focus, Brandon. You do not want to get murdered by the ghost before you can find these bunny rabbits. Oh, Peter Cottontail, where are you? I just heard something. Okay, I think we're still in the five minute grace period, so let's uh, let's get this going. All right, cool. You were here, now you're not. Ooh, oh my God, you freaking better stay close, UV light. Oh, I just heard a thump. This is terrifying with a dots projector. My hand is not actually shaking. It's just this game has like no smoothing to like your hand movement. I swear I am not scared. Okay, where'd you go? You in here? You're not in here. I kind of just went through that door. What? Jeez, I'm not in here. Whoa! God, okay, just a little janky here. All right, I need to get out of Hobbit POV. The thing is, is that you constantly drop stuff in this game when you're playing in VR, so... Things... Are... Can get a little weird. Um... Game? Oh! Alright, um... I'm not gonna touch that anymore. <laughs> um, okay. Bunny Rabbit, please say you're in here. 
before this game just completely breaks on me. Now we have to do this five times. There's five maps with this. All right, are you over here? Maybe? No. All right, where the hell are you then? So you basically, my impression is that you have to continually track down the rabbit and eventually, God, I don't know if that sound was in real life or not. And at this point, if it's in real life, it's also still kind of scary. Down the rabbit and eventually, This is so creepy. I hate this. I'm not even playing the normal game and this is awful. Where are your little footprints, you damn bastard? Did it not register that I was here? Come on. Oh, oh, oh. What the hell are you doing scratching up the walls? Okay, I don't know if that was in game or not, but I just heard what sounded like a freaking cat meowing. I don't have a cat. Uh, hang on. All right, I am actually, that kind of legit freaked me out. Um, all right, we're just gonna focus on making a video, which is the only reason I would ever do this challenge. Oh great, doors again. Okay, you didn't go in there. These are my biggest enemies so far. All right. Don't break. Come on. Wake up. Are you here? Are you at the toilet? You are not. Where is this thing then? Okay, when are we? Ah, oh, you're over here now. I like, I kind of have to like reach down a little bit. Whew. Okay, I keep hearing stuff. All right, focus, Brandon. You do not have all night to do this. <laughs> My hands are like, I feel like I'm like Spider-Man from the... Where'd you come from? Get out of here. I feel like I'm Spider-Man when he like grabs something and he can't like go of it. Okay, there we go. Are you in here, little buddy? There you are, sucker. All right, how do I do that? And then apparently you just take a picture of it. Smile. Woo! <laughs> We're fine. All right, let's grab this stuff. Um, We're done here, all right? I, uh, I think we're just gonna focus on finding rabbits today. Oh. Um, I'm sorry, UV light. I'm leaving you behind. I'm getting out of here. Uh, luckily we have the tier two flashlight, cause... Oh, that was me dropping that. I don't care. I'm out of here. Thunder is going crazy. There's weird noises potentially inside my home. We're done. We got it. We're good. Look at that. Perfect photo. You could barely even see it. This is like a cryptid photo. Whatever. Challenge complete. Whoa. I didn't even notice that before. <laughs> um, reality is failing right in front of our eyes. Okay, let's get out of here. I didn't identify. You know what? You, I might as well take a blind guess of the ghost, right? Actually, no, wait. You do lose money if you uh, get it wrong, so let's just leave. We got the bunny thing. On to the next level. I've got a report that suggests a possible ghost sighting. You don't say. All right, here we go, folks. We're locked and loaded. And we're at Grafton Farmhouse, which I hate. Not as much as Bleasdale, but these farmhouses are always so creepy and dark. Actually, we do want to grab you, Mr. Photocam. Uh, here we go. Whoa. I swear, you should not play this game. <laughs> in VR, if you can help it, it's fun for a little while, but just the fact that things just start to break down is a little overwhelming. I, God, speaking of breaking down, my brain is already rotted from this. All right, where are you bastard bunnies? Aha! There we go. It's a little helpful to lean down a little bit. Are you here? Of course you're not. All right. Oh, could have gone any of these doors. All right, here we go. Let's just open them all. <laughs> Very carefully. Ooh, that's creepy. Um, do not lose that. Hey. Mr. Stuff Bunny, I'm looking for one of your friends. Have you seen him in here? He apparently has some glow-in-the-dark laser tag paint on his feet. He went this way. <sighs> there should just be a button that opens doors automatically. All right, are you in here? You are not. I heard a noise. We're gonna ignore it for now. Anything in here? 
No. There you are. I hear it. It's kind of creepy how you can hear it, like, running around. Feet, feet, there you are. It's weird how it leaves these little scratch- Oh, I already found you, sucker! Smile! <laughs> or screech really creepily. That works for me. Alright, we are done. I'm getting out of here. This place already is giving me the creeps. It's the darkest- That's fine. We drop the thing. Alright, where's the exit? Flashlight? Um... We get lost trying to leave this place. You see what I mean by dark? I don't know if it's as dark for you guys. I mean, I, I might have, you know, corrected the brightness, but it is so difficult to see in this farmhouse. And you can't really turn on lights because otherwise you won't see the UV prints from the freaking ghost bunny. <sighs> All right. We're doing good. We did that one in about three-ish minutes. Not fantastic, but we're alive. Um, perfect. All right. Got it. Sealed it. Pack it away, boys. We're done here. Whew. Two down, three to go. All right, we are at Willow Street, which is one of my favorite maps because the ghost is seemingly in like one of three spots, the basement, the garage, or one of the bedrooms. But that doesn't mean it's gonna be necessarily that easy. Whoa, the clouds here look amazing. They're also flying like crazy. All right, here we go. Well, that was probably the smoothest door opening I've done all night. <laughs> ah, come here. I already heard a door open. Cool. Well, that doesn't help us out with bunnies. Bunnies don't open doors. Oh, there's already an egg nest there. Okay, let's get these open. <laughs> there's two of them. Our greatest challenge yet. Oh, boy. There we go. Maybe I'm getting better at that. I don't know. I don't want to jinx myself. All right, rabbit. Where are you? Ah! Of course, one of them goes into the basement. Let's start with the bedroom, shall we? Or bedrooms. Um, let's try this one. And no, I'm not avoiding the basement, even though in all likelihood it's probably there. I just have a gut feeling. Hanging out with a million ghosts that go down there. Alright. Probably not here. Yeah, no. Little bastards. Not gonna make it easy. <laughs> Alright, we're having a little more activity on this map than I'm... <laughs> the previous ones. If I could just get this door open. Let's just do this quick before the hunts begin. Okay, over here. <gasps> Hi! Oh my god! This is terrifying! It's a bunny rabbit, see? That's all I want. I don't want to mess with you. Jesus Christ. Alright, alright. You're not there? Are you sure you're not there? Alright, fine. You just <gasps> I just saw dots. Oh my god, it's on the bed. All right, I'm sorry I moved your freaking stuffed animal. I'll leave here. God. I said I was sweating earlier. Now I'm really sweating. All right, are you over here? Oh, I didn't even realize there was a nest here. But he's not there, of course. He's going over here. All right, where was that one nest? Ah. Ah, of course. All right, let's try. One of you must be in the garage. <laughs> but what did I tell you? The ghost was in the freaking bedroom. Where are you? You in here messing with my Ford F-150? Uh, where are you? I don't see where your tracks are going. Ah, okay. Are you here? Of course you're not here. My, my money is on it being in the basement, for sure. And that's probably where I'll die. <sighs> Alright, let's go. Brave. Brave, Brandon. Ghosts are not real. We're gonna ignore the door opening in your house earlier as well as the weird noise that played uh, earlier that sounded like a little cat. All right, the thing that sucks is that not only do I need to find it, I also need to get out of here. And we're getting right into the belly of the beast. Oh my God. All right, please be here. I swear, okay, oh, okay, it does, there's a second door here. That's right, that's right. Please be in here, buddy. Um, oh, bones. All right, come on. Yes, okay. Smile, motherfucker. Sweet. All right, now, I need to keep in mind the ghost can hear me. So let's, uh, oh, that's uh, fine. Oh, okay, I heard a siren. It's in real life. Come here, flashlight. And let's get out of here. Exit. I am sprinting. <laughs> I was sprinting while crouched. We got that. We got it. All right. Perfect. <laughs> Let's get out of here. 
<sighs> this is the one I was worried about the most. We're at Bleasdale. This is like one of my least favorite of like the smaller maps. It's just so hard to find the ghost here. We're gonna have a hell of a time finding the bunny. Let's get going. I hate this place so much. I hate you, Bleasdale. But we gotta find Peter Cottontail. I'm ready. I'm not happy about this, but I'm ready. Where are the bunny prints? What in the world? Where are you? I, I don't understand. Where are the bunny prints? I see eggs. I see nests. But there is no sign of the bunnies. Uh, am I missing something here? Maybe, do you need like a higher tier UV light? What about over here? Oh, God, get up. I'm just gonna leave the dots back there because I have no clue where even. I just heard something. All right, we're gonna ignore that. Just focus on, this is so far from the entrance of the house. Every other, oh, that's creepy. Every, that's creepy too. Every other start to the bunny hunt was right at the beginning of the house. Also, I should not be saying the word hunt right now because the ghost can hear me. All right, um, see, look at this. Even the flashlight sucks here. Oh my God, okay. What if we go with two UV lights? We're gonna go full rave mode here. All right. I summon the footprints of bunnies. Nothing. Maybe it doesn't, oh. maybe it doesn't start here. I'm gonna just stay crouched because that seems to be a better way to detect them, especially with these glow sticks. I do have the UV flashlight, but I kind of hate it. It's just not as effective as the glow sticks in a lot of situations. Check here. Hello? Bunny? Where's the bunny? Are you kidding me? I see so many nests, but no bunny. Okay, could it be? Hang on, I'm gonna turn on the light. I'm just. Oh, okay, good, that works. Of course, I probably won't be able to see the prints, if there are any. Ah, you sneaky bastard being in the attic. Let's go grab the dots real quick. How did I get up here? <laughs> you can tell I don't play this map very much because I don't know my way around. I think it's this way. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Mr. Flashlight, don't leave my side ever. <sighs> okay, where are you? There you are. Come here, little buddy. Do I have you? Where are you? Ah. This is like, it's so disorienting. This is like the one scenario where you just can't even see what you're trying to do. Even the simplest actions are difficult in VR. Come here. All right, let's shake you. Did I already activate you? Ah, aha. Uh -huh. Of course it's not there. It's never there on the first couple. I just heard something. I hope it was in game, which is saying something. <laughs> All right, you're not there. I knew this was gonna be rough. I didn't bring any preventative ghost hunting stuff, but at least we know it's going downstairs now. You in here, little bunny? You are not. Where are you? Uh, maybe he went in here? Oh, oh God. Oh no, all right. <laughs> I didn't want to enter the twilight zone so quickly. And you're not there, of course. I just heard something to my left. Uh, we kind of have to keep exploring this area though. Oh boy, there's a teddy bear. Where is my UV? Your head is on backwards, that's great. You wanna show me where the bunnies are? Here? Oh my God. Do we have any prints going downstairs though? That's the question. We've checked, I think, everywhere up here. Of course, now I can't figure out how to get downstairs. Ah, this way. Did we already check that? Oh, we haven't, oh, there's this whole other area. Oh, wonderful. Ah, oh, he's not there either. Watch, like the ghost's name is Peter. <laughs> I'm just like provoking it like crazy. Are you doing laundry in here, Mr. Bunny? He is not. I have a feeling it's downstairs. The game's not gonna make it easy. All right, downstairs we go. At least if we find it, we can leave lickety split. I know you got a nest in here. I already saw it once. There's, I hear something has potentially been turned on. It sounds like a sink. So it means the ghost is potentially down here, which is fine. 
I'm here to share the house, okay? This is a house of love. Oh, God! I said it was fine! Oh, my God! God, I have a full-on cold sweat going right now. Are you here? Yes! Okay. The oh, my God, I thought I lost the photo camera. Okay! <sighs> I wasn't scared. Piece of cake. Also, I heard another weird noise, I think, in real life. Okay, if I end this video and I survive, I will be happy. Um, all right. <laughs> For a second there, I'm like, how do I do this again? I need to press the button. <laughs> We're good. Wait, double check. Yes, got the photo. Sweet. <sighs> Get me out of here, man. I hate that place so much. And we were not safe for sure there at the end. Whew. All right, perfect. One more to go. Oh, this is cool. I didn't realize that was creepy that flickered. But yeah, this represents how many we've done. We've got four down, one more to go. We're almost there, great rope tree. We're almost done. Just one more location. Maple Lodge campsite, which this... Shouldn't be terrible, right? The campsite's small. I don't think it's the whole location. It's just a little behind the scenes look. This is what I do every so often to uh, keep my hands from becoming too sweaty. Okay. Uh, oh, that's really detailed. We got like satellite imagery of the campsite. I don't remember that. Shows you how much I play on this uh, location as well. Hopefully it's not snowing because that just disorients me so much. All right, here we go. One more bunny bastard to find. Oh my god, we're off to a great start. Let's drop our flashlight. Uh... What the... Where? Where... Where are... Did this open like this before? I don't remember the entrance being over here. And my god, is my flashlight dull. This is supposed to be the tier two. Oh jeez! Uh. It's really scary. I want to try and do this really quickly. I, I don't remember this place looking like this. Is this new? They must have done an update or something. Wait, is this a full campsite or is it Maple Lodge campsite? Isn't this just a few tents though? Hang on. Yeah, this is just a few tents, but there's like walls now. This is weird. All right, well, I'm going to get so lost here. Um, all right, supplies. Let's do this. Photo cam. Check. UV dots, check, check, check. Let's boogie. Hopefully this is a little bit easier to find than the last one. Okay, we got this building here. Maybe we start here? Oh, it is very creepy inside of this building. That's fine, we're just here to find a bunny and get out. Okay, we're finding this. We're, we're, aha, yes, perfect, okay. Okay, so there are some footprints going outside. We're just gonna check this one over here. You never know. It's of course not gonna be it. Yes. Um, all right, let's just go through this whole little first area. I have never been here before. Why have I never played this map? Um, okay, it may have already knocked down something out here. <laughs> this may be where our ghost is. That's okay. Oh God, it could be in any of these tents. All right, well, let's just get searching. Oh, this is going to be a whole other challenge. Ugh, get off of me! <laughs> I have to, like, toggle to grab it. It's, like, kind of tripping me up a bit. Um. Quiet. You be quiet, okay? You're scaring me. Where are the prints? Uh, yeah, they start here, but then where do they go? Ah, okay, here we go. Anything here? No. This is so creepy with the dots projector. I'm gonna turn it off. <laughs> I don't like it. Aha! Uh, either somebody's taking a piss in there or the shower turned on. Cool. Um, we're gonna go this way. Come on, where are your freaking footprints? Here we go. Nothing. Oh, wonderful. I'm gonna walk in on somebody showering. And there's noises going off. That's okay. <gasps> okay, all right. We're fine. There we go. 
Should I do that? We're gonna mind our own business. Where are you going, dude? Was the bunny taking a shower? <laughs> it would be so funny if it's actually in here. What the heck? It's not triggering. Come on, dude. You're not working? I guess not. Okay, we're just gonna ditch that one for now. Hopefully it works in the future. There seem to be tracks going this way, yes. Okay, it doesn't seem to go into the tents, which is nice. Because that's just gonna make this extremely difficult. I just heard some more branches crack. That's cool. This is just awful. It, it can go in like literally any direction. Ah. Baby, please show yourself. Yes, okay. You look great today. Fabulous. Just absolutely fabulous. Now, how do I get out of here? Oh, that's the bathroom. I don't want to go to the showers. The thing is, my lights barely do anything. The dots is kind of useful for finding my way slightly. I am going back towards the showers. That's not what we want. I'm just taking it. Ah, okay, perfect. My God, get me out of here. I hate this. Get out of here. I don't want to do this ever again. This was awful. This was almost as bad as regular ghost hunting. All right, we've got all five, so now what? Oh, man. So look at that. We've got all five lit up. Now what do we do? Oh, rope tree. I didn't actually think I would get this far. What do I do now? Okay, so I'm glad that I looked up what to do because I thought I was completely done. I thought you just find the ghost bunnies and that's it, but apparently you have to go to Camp Woodwind Identify the ghost there, which is gonna be a delight for me. And then you have to take a picture of this forest spirit. So we actually need to play the legitimate game. I didn't think I would need to. Here we go. This menu is a little jank. So we need to bring our usual supplies. I'll bring photo cam because we'll need that. I'm just gonna bring the stuff I always bring. Just be a little safe. And also, of course, we need some of this to actually identify the ghost. Um, let's bring you, okay? And that is... Most of what I want to bring, maybe I should bring sanity uh, medicine just in case. Okay, all right, Camp Woodwind, let's go. We actually have to play the legitimate game now. It's fine, it's fine. I'm warmed up, I'm warmed up. I'm a little freaked out, but I'm warmed up. Oh, thank God, at least this is a map that I know, Camp Woodwind, and it's not big. So hopefully, hopefully, we can do this safely. All right, flashlight, you're going here. Boom, uh, I'm gonna grab UV. Because I don't think it gives you any free stuff this time. We're going to hold you and you. Look at that. Two detection equipment. Now, luckily... Oh, as I was saying. Luckily, we do have the tier two EMF. Oh, I hate this map when it's snowing. Let's get this door open. Ugh. There we go. That was smooth. See? I'm getting used to it. The thing that sucks with the snow at this map is that it really messes with the ghost orbs. Okay. Ooh. I don't know if that noise was me or a ghost. Hello? Give me a sign. I'm so terrified to actually be playing a normal game. Because I... Ooh, oh! It's just my breath. Which it is about 5 degrees Celsius. Now that's normal, because it is snowing. I'm going to drop you. I don't like dropping the EMF, but I kind of have to to open this. Ah, get off my hand. Okay, I thought something moved in here. Temperature stable. It is so creepy in VR. Just the woods in general, the ambience, the atmosphere. Can I just like, I just really want this campfire to be lit. I know there's, can we uh, get some more lights? That's a little nicer. Of course, it'll probably blow the fuse or knock the power out at some point. Give me a sign. Something's over here. Something is definitely on this side. And yes, I am still permanently crouched for some reason. <laughs> I don't need to be anymore. Oh my god, be quiet. You're gonna trip me up. There's just no activity right now. Oh, that scared me. I forgot there's a generator here. Isn't there sometimes Slender Man, like over there? I can't see him. Oh my god, what was that? Is that? I feel like I hear like some kind of water rushing. Oh no, it's not water. It's a. Is this a grill? Temperatures dropping. Okay, well this must be the spot then. 
Um, did it... Ooh. Okay. You're here for sure. Also, that door is open by default. I should check that for uh, UV, right? Okay. <laughs> it definitely touched this. Um, how do I... How do I op open you back up so I can test for UV? Ooh. It's two. Oh, it just opened that one, too. Um, okay, I need to get this... Oh, like, close it back up, right? Because otherwise, how do I see the fingerprints? I don't know where to grab you. I'm just grasping <laughs> fabric. How do I do this? Oh, this is going to be a struggle, I can already tell. How we look in freezing temps? It is freezing. Okay, all right, so we've got that. Let's, uh... Oh, I'm so flustered right now. It's like a first date, me and you, ghosts. I'm just so nervous. Freezing temps, okay, we got that. Question is, how do you close this? How do you how do you do this? The ghost is watching me the whole time. It's just like, what is this guy doing? I can't, I can't, I can't possibly get that to do anything. All right, we're gonna turn this off. Okay, it's still moving around out there. I'm gonna go grab the video camera. So let's do that. Well, we can grab two things, can't we? We'll grab dots and this. Perfect. Well, this is the first time using the video camera here. This is so crazy. I had to like hold it right up to my face to see any amount of detail. Okay. Oh, that's going off. Three. Okay, can we see dots here? Huh. Dots are ghost orb. Come on. Oh, that's ghost orb. Oh my god, I'm so surprised I saw it. Okay, will that have UV? Uh, eh. Thank you for being kind to me. Okay. No UV. Alright, let's take some notes. Okay, we got... Ghost orb, UV, ghost writing is still an option, EMF is not an option, dots is still an option, unfortunately. Okay, all right. Um, let's see here. Uh, let's set up the video camera. Oh my god, did I drop my flashlight? Okay, there we go. Okay, how do I actually set up the video camera anyway? Ooh. Dude, can you give me a second? I'm like trying to play the game in the most casual way possible. God. This is so difficult. This is why I don't play the real game like this. Let's get some more tools. And I'm gonna keep an eye on the cam, just in case. Sanity is at the, about what it should be. I don't think this is a ghost that's really affecting our sanity. Come on, give me dots. It would make me so happy. Well, this is kinda cool. I can keep an eye on that and this. Um, it could be these three. So we need the book and we need spirit box. Actually, you know what? God's coming with me too. <laughs> I'm scared. I don't know. Oh, I dropped this cross. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> we are falling apart. All right, where did I? Where did the cross go? Oh no! Did Jesus? I think Jesus ditched me. I can't find the cross. It's like flown away. Okay, that's fine. At least we still have our book. Our dirty, crappy notebook. All right, let's. Uh, where is my flashlight? Oh my god, dude. Stop dropping stuff. Okay, let's go. All right, let's deploy you. Can I just set you down? Okay, perfect. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna put you in view of the... <gasps> okay, it's right here. This is the time for the spirit box. Are you here? Are you friendly? Where are you? Ooh. Oh god, the noises here really scare me. Oh my god, I hate this thing. Um, okay, I don't, ooh. it's right there, are you young, are you old, where are you, it's not talking to me at all, it's gotta be Dodds, man, ooh. Ooh. <gasps> okay, that wasn't a hunt, but I am done, okay, do I have to, I didn't mean to do that. Do I have to find evidence of everything? Hmm. I guess it could still be ghostwriting. I didn't check that. Where are you? <laughs> there you are. I still might need you. Don't go anywhere. All right. Let's just check the book. See what we have. It hasn't written in the book yet either. Oh, wait. It has written in the book. I am stupid. I am the dumbest. Okay. <laughs> here I am just risking my life trying to get evidence. And yet it just wrote in the book. It's like, dude, I'm right here. So we've correctly. All right. Let's see. Ghostwriting, it is a revenant. 
wonderful. One of the worst ghosts. I hate the Revenant so much. Okay, so this last part I'm not looking forward to. I need to take a photo of the ghost. So here we go. It's a Revenant. It's really dangerous. I am not looking forward to this. Hello? Oh, God. Chill out there, flappy boy. Um... Yeah, so... You camp often? I hate that I can just hear everything I say. Do you like bunny rabbits? Do you like Easter? Do I have to do this? Do I really have to provoke it? It is getting really active, boys. I just gotta get a photo of this thing. I, I, I considered filming myself with a camera in real life for this video. I'm glad I didn't, because I probably look insane. If we see it, we're going that way, okay? We'll loop it. How do we provoke it? Um, should I be mean? All right, let's do this. Can you hunt me, please? Fuck you. Kill! Oh, Jesus. I don't like this. I just want to run to the truck and pee my pants, okay? I'm scared. Where are you? Show yourself. I just need a photo of you. Are you ready for your photo debut? Fuck you. Fight. Come on. Show yourself. You're a revenant. You're dangerous. Come on. Do a hunt. I'm acting like so confident, but I am not right now. I'm just focusing on not dropping the camera. Come on, fight me. Punk bitch, let's do this. I'm ready. I'm ready for a hoedown. Do you know what a hoedown is? Well, I don't really either, but I'm ready for one. I better be centered in this floor. I'm gonna run into the wall as soon as this thing appears. <sighs> I'm getting bored. Can you please show up? Paging Mr. Ghost. The one time I am against a revenant and I actually wanted to hunt. This is ridiculous. I'm going back to the drawing board. I don't know what's going on. Like its activity is so low, it's not hunting and yet it's a revenant. I'm so upset this thing is not hunting. After all that, to identify the ghost and it just doesn't show up. Okay, you're here. Hunt, hunt, hunt. Wait. Oh, I thought that was five. Wait, I just dropped my fucking flashlight. Ah, oh, my glasses. Where is it? Ah. Ooh! It's behind me. It's behind me. Where's my... Oh. That wasn't a real hunt. Okay. But I was ready. Did you see that? How quickly I got my photo cam out? Oh. Oh. My hands are shaking. Alright. Here we go. Do that again. Show yourself. I just need to do it one more time. Oh. oh, it's right there. Like, oh, I can't see it. Did I get a photo of it or not? Ah! Oh my god! Oh. Oh my god. I couldn't see it. Did I get a photo? Did it count? Oh, I died. Oh, is that me? Why is my hair so tie dye? <laughs> it looked weird. Uh, did I get it? Welcome back. Like for bed okay, I got the right ghost type. Bone evidence. Oh, my photo didn't count. Are you kidding me? I pointed right in the direction it was at. Oh my god. You've got to be kidding me. We're going to do this again, but we're going to do it a little bit differently. This time, there is a 100% chance of a summoning circle. And I also boosted some of my character's stats to make myself a little bit more uh, less easy to kill, I guess. All right, here we go. Round two. Let's do this. We have this. We can do this. Wonderful. Par for the course. The ghost is awful. All right. Boom, boom, boom. It really sucks when you do carry two items at a time that you have to basically drop one of them to interact with stuff, but whatever. Boom. Ugh. All right. We've got this. We've got this. All right. Here we go. Let's see if we can find the ghost. I'm already hearing noises. Whoa. Wow, that was really quick. Wow, that... That took literally no time. It's right here. And there's... Look at that. 
what have we got here? Is that, is that unique? Hang on. I can't tell. It looks like it just has five fingers. Otherwise, that would be a dead giveaway. All right, we've got two on the EMF. I need to find out where the summoning circle is. Uh, we're not going to use it right away, but it'll be good to figure out where it's at. I'll leave that EMF over there. If it goes off again, we'll rush back. There's a generator. Would the summoning circle be in the bathroom? No. Okay. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay, and I'm pretty sure I brought matches, luckily. Which we will need, but okay, let's solve this mystery. So we have, right off the bat, we have, gosh, the journal is so bright. We have ultraviolet. Sweet. Let's actually get all of the tools out there right now. I'm gonna go ahead and set this up over here. Let's set up the dots as well. Let's grab some more stuff. I also really need to remember to bring that with me at some point. Just in case this thing pops up randomly, at least I'll have a photo of it. This ghost is making so many noises all around me. And honestly, it wouldn't surprise me if it was twins, just how much it's interacting in so many different locations. That was a ghost orb right there. Perfect. It's so much easier to see on this screen. So if we have ghost orbs in ultraviolet, it could still potentially be Mimic, because that has ultraviolet, and it also can give ghost orbs. Okay, so it's definitely not going to be Spirit Box, which is great, because I'm terrible with that. And it's not going to be Ghost Riding. All right, so let's see here. we got to keep an eye on the dots, see if we can get EMF 5 and maybe some freezing temps. It is right out there, man. All right, let's get this going. Oh, you know what I should do? You need to be close at hand, and I'll probably just ditch you. There we go, perfect. Because we need that at like a moment's notice. So these two are our best bet in order to actually find the ghost. And I'm hoping maybe by some random chance we'll see it on the dots. God, that shadow from my hand scared the crap out of me. Uh, it can hunt now, so we do have to be careful. Watch, this one will be extremely active. Ooh, I'm seeing my breath. Uh, where is the thermometer? I dropped it. I feel like Velma looking for her glasses. There we go. Ooh. Uh, I saw my breath, but my god, this ghost is so active, it is literally moving something every few seconds. Okay, two on the EMF, but that's not good enough. I am hearing so many things all around me right now. I almost just want to shut up at this point and listen. This is so eerie. Man, it seems to be kind of chilling out right now. I'll tell you what. I'm going to leave these things here again. I'm going to reposition the dots. See if we get a better angle on that. And I'm going to review my notes and see what kind of ghosts we may be dealing with. Come on, baby. Show up in the dots. Do something. Okay, so it could be a Banshee, a Hantu, or an Obake. Shapeshifters. Okay. Well... The fingerprints just look like a regular five-handed fingerprints, but if we do see the ghost and it changes form, then it could be an Obake. And a Hantu is a rare ghost that thrives in the coldest climates. More aggressive when it's cold. Okay. Well, it hasn't even gotten that cold yet. Then again, it's probably different all over the campsite, which will make it hard to find. And a Banshee. Hmm. Can be heard screaming with Parabolic Mike, which I didn't bring because I didn't want to lose any more money. I didn't see anything on the dots, and I kept checking out of the corner of my eye. I guess let's see what we can give it the thermometer and EMF. At least we can hold both of them at once. Oh boy. That didn't take long. Temperature is freezing. Okay. <laughs> There's our answer. Okay. So it is... What is that? Freezing temps? That, that's the Hantu, right? Now, potentially, it could be a mimic. Which would really suck. I guess the only way we could rule it out is by using the spirit box, but I already suck with that so much. I don't trust myself. We'll go with Hantu, and we'll try to summon this thing. You know what I could do? Okay, I have my photo cam. I could bring the smudge stick with me as well, and that'll keep me safe-ish. Maybe. I don't know. Here we go. We're going to give it a shot. Oh, it is over here. It is literally right here. Do we even need to do this? Um. Oh, my God. My smudge stick shadow scared me. Oh, relax, man. All right. I can't even see. I wish the flashlight followed your head. Uh, it is getting really active right now. Please light. Uh, how do I light with this? How do you use the matches when you're not... When you're in VR? Ignite. Please. How do I do this? Oh, you grab it. Okay. This is scary. 
But everything's fine. We're just gonna light these creepy candles, and then we're gonna run like hell. Okay. Oh, stand up, you fool! Oh, it's chasing us. Okay. Flashlight is out. Where is it? Oh, we're gonna take a photo regardless. It is very slow. Oh, that's it right there. I'm taking a bunch of photos of you. Oh. It is throwing stuff like crazy. All right, I think I got a photo of it. It is very slow though. Okay, ooh, it's daunting. Okay, okay, maybe we're safe. Um, I wanna throw the co camera over there. Interesting that you can do that in this uh, VR setting. Okay, oh, I am shaking. Oh, that really got to me. Okay, did I get the photo? Did I get it? Proof of the forest spirit, which <laughs> you can't even see it. It's so dark. But we freaking did it, baby. Boom. Mic drop. Flashlight drop. I don't care. Hopefully we got the right ghost, though. Oh, God, that was intense. I don't think I've ever used a summoning circle in VR, even when I was super brave playing with my friends, but we did it. All right. Now, the lobby should change, I think. Welcome back. Um, it didn't. But we definitely accomplished it. We got the right ghost. We didn't get bone evidence. It didn't give us a photo bonus for some reason, but uh, maybe you just don't... Oh, it's probably because of the bonus rewards get zeroed out. I'm not sure. Well, uh, I did see that it's possible that the lobby could get bugged, so I'm going to exit and rejoin, and maybe it'll be fixed. Welcome back. Aha! So, there we go. Ooh, so pretty. We did it. Rope tree, whatever the hell you are, we did it. That's the first seasonal event I've ever done. It's actually kind of cool. I did it in VR too. And it didn't take that long. It only took like maybe an hour or two. And I didn't really necessarily know what I was doing most of the time. So it's pretty cool. But yeah, um, like this video guys, please. It always helps. Leave a comment. Let me know if you want to see more videos like this because I love Phasmo. I play it for fun and I can force myself to play it more in VR. If you guys would like, maybe I'll continue to do more seasonal events in VR because, uh, I don't know, it's a unique little challenge in this game that I really enjoy. And subscribe, of course, if you want to see more of my antics. But until the next video, peace.